supposed to be your moment, ain't it? It's supposed to be your moment. It's supposed to be your moment. It's supposed to be your moment. What good is being the one when you're the only one that knows it? Hey man, it's the ISO guy, Sensei. Make sure y'all subscribe if you new, man. Help me hit 262k. Check, check, check the shoes. You got late ass Converse. I know, but I like these Converse. Anywho, man, in this video, this is a Christmas noob special, bro. I'm gonna be telling y'all the best builds, the best meta builds in the game. Timestamp. I'm gonna be telling y'all the best meta builds, all competitive builds in the game, all sorted out for you, man. I'm gonna give you the best power forward builds. And I'm going to give you the best lockdown builds and the best PG builds and the best spot up builds and the best center builds. So, hey man, make sure y'all follow me on Twitch, man. I'm going to be streaming tonight. And make sure y'all go to my second channel, man. I dropped a hilarious rage times, man. Go down below. It will be time stamped for you. And then there will be several builds within that goddamn timestamp. And um, it'll be explained. All that other bullshit. And um, y'all let me know down below if for Christmas... You secure the next gen console because god damn man shit looking tough my nigga what we got like ten thousand niggas on the game but um yeah i did all the science for you my nigga there's no point in making a shooting guard this year you either go pg for the little midget pgs you don't you don't go small forward for a pg there's no point the only reason you'll need to go small forward is if you want to make the best lockdown build right that's the fastest um other than that bro if you're gonna make a small pg he has to be at pg okay um if you don't make him at pg you might as well just make a, a power forward that, that that's just how this game is power forward or at least for guards and shit like that power forward or PG or small forward for lockdown for 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 the best bang for your buck, my nigga. And um, so y'all make sure y'all watch this full video. Let me know what you. There's a lot of intricacies, man. I'm a, I'm gonna go down, and I'm a, I'm gonna explain it to you. But through finishing all the way down low, and I'm gonna let you know why. And my physicals are max, my nigga. This shit, this this build is crazy, bro. So we're going to bring that drive and layup to 92, bro. 92. That's high as hell, bro. 6'7", 6'11". Come on, my nigga. We're going to bring that drive and dunk to 94. Plus 4, 98 drive and dunk. Hall of Fame posterizer with how many badges? A lot of niggas done mess up their builds. I see niggas with two, five, four badges. Nigga, mm. We got 11, nigga. 11. 11. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me. Oh, <laughs> that's what I really meant to do. You know, finesse. That's what you could do with this builder, man. Hey, have y'all noticed that even though it's not pie charts, it's still pie charts. Like, it's just a, it's a genjutsu. It's a new presentation, man. It's like hidden pie charts within these little attributes and shit. It's hard to explain. But look, so 95 midi, that means I'm going to have a 99.3 or uh, midi, 99 midi, 6'7", 6 6'11", 6 wingspan. Look, look at this. Now, I'm finna break the game right here, bro. Right here, right here. Watch for it. And look, a lot of y'all say, you don't need that much shooting for what, the shooting badges I'm finna show you. But look, listen, bro, listen. It makes the game a lot easier. And a lot of y'all are trash and, you know, lag, all types of stuff. Just comp. See, look, it's just like, why in all these other years did people make play shots? Not talking about 2K21 current gen, um, by the way. Why did they make play shots? Why didn't they just make a slashing playmaker or a playmaker? They could still run through the screen and shoot hella threes, get hella greens. But why did they choose the play shot? Because it makes it that much easier to green, bro. It you you don't have to focus in as hard, bro. You don't have to lock in with hall with Hall of Fame deep range, bro. It's just gonna make the game so much easier, bro. For you comp niggas, you really understand, bro. When you get on a play shot any year of 2K, bro, it makes you look 
like you're way better than you actually are. Because if you use gold badges, you would struggle, bruh. You know, you wouldn't be shooting seven threes like every game if they leave you open. Like just green, 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 green. You know, with a slash and playmaker, you lucky if you get three of them holes green, you know? You might do two for three, but if you go three for three, that's a real good game for a slash and playmaker. For a play shot, that's normal. But look, so look, look at this. 28 shooting badges at 6'7". And I'm going to have Hall of Fame Limitless, bro, at 99. 28. Y'all remember all them lame niggas that had them 30 shooting badges just fading, being unstoppable? I can do that with this build at 6'7", 6'11", wingspan, bro. I can ISO, do all that. 28, nigga. And I know y'all probably think my pat, my uh, playmaking and my defense is going to be... Uh, like lower no nigga you my physicals no nigga you gonna see bruh them hoes is max nigga this is crazy to have a build like this with 28 bruh i found a finesse y'all heard it here first and y'all start to see build similar it started here now we're gonna bring the pass accuracy to 70 right um at 71, you unlock floor general. So when I'm 96, I will unlock gold floor general. Um, I would like to unlock Hall of Fame dimer, but that takes going up a little too high. You have to be for power four, you have to have 85. So that means I would have to have like my shit on an 81, and I ain't with it. 70, uh, I, if my passing slow, I'm gonna have bullet passer to use. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna put that hoe on 70. Y'all gonna see why, bro. I tried to get it higher, but th this is enough playmaking, bro. 20 playmaking. Hall of Fame quick first step off rip. You know? The quick first step is 81, you see? So that means I would have to have like a, a 78 or some shit, 77, you know, just quick math. I don't, I don't give a fuck if it's wrong. So, off rip. I'm going to have be have access to this shit. Now, my interior, I really wanted to upgrade my interior, bro, because that shit matter. Right. But I could only get it to 35, bro. But at least it's 10 more than none. And I'm going to be able to run Hall of Fame rim protector and gold intimidator. 611 wingspan, 67. Do I even need it? Who knows, bro? Nobody's really tested the game, bro. But look. 94 perimeter defense that means it's going to be a 98 at 99 84 block my nigga max rebounding bro i'm a horse centers my vertical is going to be higher than centers nigga i'm gonna be faster look look at this 18 look at this look at this hold on let, let, let me let, let me show you the physicals before i get into the defense Look at this shit, my nigga. Look at this shit, my nigga. This is the build. This is the build, man. Drop a like, subscribe if you new. Look, bro. Look. This is a god. Now, a lot of y'all be like, why don't you upgrade close shot? Why don't you put more on pass accuracy? Why don't you put some on steel? Listen, you don't have the game. You don't have the builder. You don't understand this game is weird, bro. If you put any into steel or any of this other shit, you'll, you have way less badges, bro. Like, way less. This is the best way. This is why you see people making their builds certain way and not upgrading certain things. Like, you know? But look, 84 block, man. And, and that helps with contest. Wait till y'all see these takeovers, my nigga. I'm gonna be able to horse. Look at my speeds. Bro, most power forwards they don't have physicals like this they have lower physicals man this is high this is high physicals for a power forward bro you feel me like the 90 i'm gonna have a 99 stamina 87 vert with a 98 dunk hall of fame posterizer hall of fame limitless 28 shooting badges 20 playmaking and 18 
defensive badges, bro. I'm going to really be able to guard ball and not have to depend on locks. Finally, you know, they made that the trend in fucking uh, 2K19, bro. Shit trash. And this is 77 badges. And shout out to my chat, you know, trying to help me with the build and all that other shit. Appreciate y'all little niggas. Make sure y'all follow me on Twitch. If you want help with builds and you want to see me make these hoes live and go crazy and drop niggas off. But this build, bro, I, 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 I don't know, bro. I think it's like really the best, bro. The best power forward. Um, man, I, I really, I really, I really feel that way, bro. Y'all, let me know how you feel, man. I don't think there's a more all-around build, bro. That's just like dominating, like on just different levels, my nigga. That that bro that I, I I really believe that Hall of Fame Limitless bro I really think that that's a game changer and these twenty eight shooting badges I I think it's a game changer because y'all remember in two K twenty one current gen even though shooting is way easier this year if you had goal shooting even with an eighty five you know three you wasn't hitting you wasn't hitting like niggas with Hall of Fame badges. I'm going to have all Hall of Fame badges. You feel me? I don't know. And look at this build name, man. Y'all let me know if y'all seen a lot of scoring machines, man. Check me out. Hey, don't, don't my nigga like he can take your bitch. I don't know how I'm measured to Zeon, bro. Um, <laughs> Count, even though it's still an amazing, ba amazing badge count. Now, watch how the finesse swan work, man. So look, I'm going to go down step by step, man. Young LeBron, we're going to give him a 80 layup, right? We're going to give him a max dunk. 94 dunk, it's going to be a 98. 84 layup, you know, once you hit 99, we're going to give him a 40 standing dunk, okay? I know a lot of people like to say all oh, that athletic flushes shit. That shit is ass. I've been, never used that for years. The, um, the best standing dunk is the regular one we're gonna give him a max post control broken <laughs> um i'm pretty sure post control affects other stats um that they don't show anymore i'm not too sure what it is i forget now i know lebron can shoot way better than what's going to be displayed but again i had to take away his shooting so he could still when compared to the mj build so he could still, so he could have way more defense, okay? God defense, you're going to see. Um, this is enough to to cook anybody, bro. Again, you know? And you're, you're still, you're still going to have the Hall of Fame deep range while having this um, low shooting, and you, you don't need it. Look, you're going to have a 94-3, you know? 78 midi, and you're going to actually have some free throw. I know a lot of niggas don't have no free throw, but you're going to actually have some free throw. This is the finesse. And look, wait, I, I, I'll actually show y'all after the build with the shooting so I can show you why I actually did this. Um, We're going to bring the pass accuracy to 70. I wish it could be higher, but um, you, you, you're you going to miss out on other badges everywhere else. A lot of you won't understand. We're going to bring the interior to 50. Because that's the interior you can have and not have any strength. I know a lot of y'all talk about all this strength shit, all this, that. Man, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> so we're going to bring his perimeter to 95. That is a 99 perimeter defense. That means 99 lateral quickness. We're going to bring his steel to 92. You're going to have his steel. Okay. We're going to bring his block to 84. That's an 88. And we gonna max this out. We gonna bring this to 74. Mmm. 26 defensive badges. 26. You know? My MJ build, it, you, you, you'll, you'll just have to go see. It has so much shooting. It's a fucking god, bro. And then, you get amazing physicals. Voila. You feel me? I think this is a phenomenal build. You see, now the whole logic behind this is, okay, 
you got the 11 finishing, you know, contact dunks, you, 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 you got enough finishing to be a god, right? This is a finesse. You, 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 you would have to be a genius to finesse your shit like this. Soon everyone else is going to catch on. I've been hip, been teaching the niggas. And look, for instance, like with this 13, right? If I was to do this, you only get 11. You see, um, you could do this if you want and like not get anything else anywhere else. You know, like for instance, like if I was to put it on strength, you, you get nothing. <laughs> But so I finessed it and then I actually get more. Um, I get some free throw if I was to play rec with this nigga or pro am, you know, big finesse, genius swan, genius swan down in the comments. And um, so I get that 94 three ball, even the gold badges that you see, they're going to turn purple once I'm like 99 or higher overall. So yeah, already got Hall of Fame quick first step off rip, the pass accuracy lit. I'm gonna have floor general. I think all I have to do is hit 96 and yeah, same with those badges. A lot of them are going to go purple. Some aren't. You got some interior. Mike Wang patched it and made it matter more to help with contest and shit like that. And I have a high steel, bro. So like I know a lot of people are running no steel, no interior D. But now with this, you got some, my nigga. Again. You you could tweak this, bro. You don't you know a lot of y'all try to bash my builds like like I'm just some idiot. Like I haven't had a a 90 plus or 95 plus win percent every year and comp niggas pull up on me and I stream. You are like y'all are just idiots. Like you niggas aren't good at the game, but it's it's weird. But I will only give y'all comp builds, bro. This a comp build to me. You don't gotta get someone to really guard with like max interior. You don't have to do switch offs as much with someone who has max interior on your team, you can do it yourself and you can rip a lot of these niggas, man. You know you're going to have Hall of Fame clamps, Hall of Fame interceptor, unlike a lot of builds, Hall of Fame pickpocket, unlike a lot of builds, you know, it's 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 deadly, my nigga. I, I, I think this is nice. I ain't going to hold you. I'm personally not going to make this myself. I already have enough builds, but hey, if y'all do end up making this hoe, Hit me on Twitter. I would love to use it, my nigga. I don't know. If, if you're going for straight offense, finish your move, spot up. If you, you know, you could do something like this. It doesn't fucking matter, bro. And here goes the build name, man. Floor Space and Slasher. Being Bryant, man. You know, Kobe was like 6'6", six, six, you know? You know, so we, 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 we got 6'7". This is like close to his weight. And we just gonna give him a demigod wingspan to, to really to really make him crazy, man. So check me out, man. <clears throat> so we gonna give him a 94 layup. And hey, if any of y'all make this build, bro, hit me on Twitter so I can use it for a video, my boy. You know, 95, you feel me? So look, you gonna have a 98 layup, a 99 contact dunk. Pretty toxic, eh? <laughs> Standing dunk, fuck it, nigga. So look, we gonna give him. Actually, I'll revisit this again. You got 16 finishing, my nigga. Shit crazy, right? You gonna have 18 shooting. That's miraculous, you know? Miraculous. You gonna have an 88 three ball, 94 midi. You gonna have 18 playmaker. I know it's so so right now. It's so so right now, right? Yeah, right now, nigga. But wait till you see the defense, my nigga. We're going to give him a 50 interior, okay? So you're going to be able to stop niggas in the interior much better than others. 95 perimeter. You're going to have a 65 steal. That means you are going to be able to unlock pickpocket. I know that hole don't pop up, right? It pop up at 69. That, you know, plus four. You get it, guys? You get it? You know, plus four, that means at 99, you're going to be able to unlock gold pickpocket. And you already have interceptor. Okay, so if alley-oops are OP again like last year, that couldn't be stopped. You do need a high interceptor and a decent steal and um, long wingspan to stop that shit. So you're going to be a much better defender than people who don't have interior or steel. You're going to have a, a 97 block, my nigga. Wait, hold on, hold on. Damn, this nigga looking godlike, eh? You're gonna have 25 defensive badges, bro. 
This looks crazy, right? This looks crazy. You can guard ball and go crazy. Primary ball handler, second. Look at this baby face grandpa always ruining my goddamn videos, my nigga. Make sure y'all follow me on all my social media. Like the video, dickhead. But look, so look, this nigga look crazy, right? This is what y'all think? I, I think this is goaded, nigga. So look, you got max speed, max acceleration, no strength, and you got max stamina. We are complete, my nigga. We are complete. Now, if you want this standing dunk, like, and shit, look, let me show you a trick. You could have 15 like this, right? But if you don't care for standing dunk, I don't care for standing dunk. I mean, you could do it like this or like this, but I rather have it to where I get 16 badges. If I was to make this personally, um, y'all let me know what you prefer. You know, um, I would do this. You know, you're going to have an 88 speed, 99 stamina. I mean, you took stamina off like you're not really you're not upgrading anything else, really. It's too long, man. Pick what you want, man. And this is the build name, man. I wish there were more build names in the game, man. We got Jason Tatum and Chris. Um, do what you want. I would go burly if you want more like comp because you appear bigger than what you actually. So look, man, here we go. We are finna start right here, my boy. I'm gonna do it from top to, to, to bottom, man. So make sure you don't skip. So you really understand the build, man. So look, we gonna give him a driving layup of 94. I know his layup not that high, but look, we going for badges, my boy. They gave him an 82 layup, you know, so it's still too high. They gave him a 65 driving dunk, but we gonna give him an 84, you know? He ain't got the 99 like the rest. And we just gonna max out these attributes for 13 finishing badges. That's pretty godlike, right? And post control, I think that ties into post hooking so with this nigga you're gonna be able to be a little post score it's toxic as fuck right crazy as hell man we're gonna bring his midi to 75 even though he shoots a better midi than his three point i know he played overseas and he shot terrible even though he barely played but we still gonna give him a 95 three ball <laughs> just 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 to be but look look y'all gonna understand why he has so much extra shooting and finishing because I max the playmaking and it's leftover badges. You can't put it on defense, my nigga, you know? So you might as well, you know, make them an all around build. And you know, you don't want no free throw. Look at this, let me show you a trick, man. So look, you got 20 shooting badges, okay? They said he was a terrible shooter. They gave him a 70 close shot, 72 mid, and a 71 three, bro. That's crazy. I thought he was a shooter. I thought he was a deep range shooter, but you know, he out here shooting uh 25 and you know, all that, you know, y'all be on Westbrook. Westbrook shoot way better than that. But look, if you was to just do something like this, you get 14. But look, I'm a genius, my nigga. I broke in the game. I'm a genius. Genius one. Teacher swan. But you get 20 doing it like this. Thank me later. Thank me later. Thank me later. <laughs> Can I get a thank me later down in the comments? Now, let me give him the playmaking. This is what he's known for, being a facilitator, etc., man. So look, we're going to bring it down to the 91 to give him 30 maxed playmaking badges so he got all this shit all of it all of it 30 of them 30 i'm tripping bro look so here's his defense man i don't know anything about him being a defender y'all let me know um how y'all feel about that and look so we're gonna give him nine defensive badges man i know you could go with more y'all can adjust this how you want if you want to use this as a base for a build because this nigga gonna have a 99 three with 20 badges that's kind of crazy but, um, yeah, bro, um, yeah. And look, then he got godlike physicals. Max speed, max acceleration, max stamina. Now look, here's at the ending, man. You can either do 65 vert or 63, and then you could bring this to 65, you know? So it's, it's better overall, I guess, for, like, rebounding. Or you can up the vertical, man. It's personally up to you bro um if any of y'all make this build hit me up on twitter i would love to use it i'm not gonna personally make this build myself because i already got my god power forward build but this is it this comp you know um of course you know you would have to run with other 
you know, primary or better lockdown defenders. But this is a nice facilitator. Got a nice shot. Got great finishing. He got enough defensive badges. And a lot of y'all, interior defense, if you guys did not know, it has been proven by 2K Lab. And Mike Wang has admitted himself that interior defense does not help paint defense, right? Does not help you get blocks. It helps post defense. <laughs> Crazy, right? Block helps your contest in the paint and on the perimeter, etc. man. But look, let's go with it. I'm gonna show you one, but yeah. And look, I'm gonna give y'all this stupid rare ass build name. Let me know if y'all seen this this year so far. I haven't seen it. Check me out. Offensive oriented four. I don't know how to what you did to Westbrook, bitch ass nigga. But we gonna start from top to bottom, man. So look, we gonna bring the layup to a 93. The driving dunk to 88. You're going to be able to unlock heli contact dunks. Standing dunk to 80. That's going to give you 12 finishing. That's miraculous. You know, the real KD probably does have a little bit more finishing. Um, To be honest, he's a great finisher. Nigga, big as shit. And he can shoot like a god. So it's like the nigga's like unstoppable. Um, The shooting, look, his shooting is miraculous, my nigga. So we're going to give him 30 shooting badges, bro. Yes, we're going to give him 30 shooting badges. If you were to take some off of shooting and stuff, it really wouldn't be true to him, my nigga, because this is what he truly excels in. And it's, it's not going to really put any extra points on anything else. You're just going to be a normal power forward. You want to be you want to have the maximized ability than any other power forward that gets all these goddamn shooting badges. This is why I went with 30 for, 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 for a KD build, my nigga. We're gonna bring this pass accuracy to 67. You're gonna be able to get bullet pass or gold. You'll be good, you'll be cool, my nigga. You will be cool. We're gonna max these two out. You're gonna be able to have pro dribble moves. Uh, you know, I heard some KD builds out there don't got pro dribble moves. You're gonna be able to have pro dribble moves and you're gonna be able to unlock Hall of Fame quick first step at, um, what overall is it at uh 90 fucking six or seven one of those you're gonna be able to unlock it and you unlock hall of fame limitless at 99 okay now 86 we're gonna give him a 51 steal i did want it to be higher but i mean this is gonna help you get those interceptions niggas spamming alley-oops or other shit like that maxed out block you gonna have an 88 block you gonna have miraculous rebounding you gonna have 16 defensive badges my nigga um kd is an amazing defender um because of his 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 um just his size pause um he has been on some great defensive teams well only uh golden state warriors whatever he did in golden state none of that counts because the team is just brilliantly coached they had a brilliant defensive team helping system to where he could really go on the prowl and act like he's out here d and lebron up knowing damn well if he was not on the golden state warriors he would not be able to stick that nigga like that because there's it's no worries when you have no worries of anyone else being able to score and your team being amazing defensively you can guard niggas like that right um Y'all niggas probably like, this nigga made a KD bid just to talk shit. Fuck KD, nigga. Nigga done stole some of Westbrook's MVPs and shit. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. And look, max physicals, man. So, you know, you 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 looking good out there, my nigga. This, this is niggas a god. This is the build, bro. Now, you could make it overall all around, but, you know, look. You're finishing, you're unstoppable. You're shooting, you're unstoppable. You're going to have a lot of bailouts with that shit. Your playmaking, it's going to be enough to speed boost and be as fast as possible and, and be true to KD, right? It's going to be good enough for him, right? And you still got miraculous defense. This this builds a demigod, my nigga. This is big as you could be and get Hall of Fame deep range. I, I think I think this is the best layout for, for a KD build. And then, you know, all, all this other shit. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know if I should make this build and play with it. You know, me and KD at the park going crazy. Oh, hold on. Let me, I gotta, 
one strength for you niggas that uh <laughs> one strength for you niggas that be like but um i just want limitless so you could just fade from um beyond the half court and just be toxic and you are going to be a goddamn three levels you want to appear bigger than you are burly gang down in the comment section man hey man finesse and swan finesse and swan so look you're gonna have a 99 dunk on this lock you're gonna have a 80 driving layup, not max, you know, finesse and swan, finesse and swan. And you're going to have a 74 post control. If you want to do stand and dunk, you can. You can. You can. It's 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 perfectly up to you, bro. But if you want the most badges for how I'm about to build this nigga, you got to do it like this. See? Actually, forget everything I just said. For how I'm building this, this is how you get the most finishing badges, right? So look. Okay, okay, so you're gonna have over a 93 or 95 midi, um, unless you feel like changing this. Looking pretty good, right? Now we're getting into the playmaking, man. So you're going to be able to unlock pro dribble moves at 99. You're gonna have five playmaking. For all you guys that love playmaking, you will have a high ass speed with ball. Oh my god, oh my god! dickhead ass nigga hey drop a like and let me know if you see my other lockdown builds without uh playmaking bro and look at me you feel me we not playing no games max nigga 30 defensive mm -hmm. 30 defensive is overkill man shut up man we maximize possibilities over here my nigga and you gonna have these and these, and you even got a little strength for you little dickheads. You can run a little uh, gold brick wall. And then you got max stamina, 99. You know, niggas zigzagging behind screens, all that other shit. You good. So you are going to be able to unlock Hall of Fame Rim Protector. I know it says that. Um, but only gold intimidator. Uh, So look, your speed gonna be lit. Your acceleration gonna be lit. Everything gonna be lit, my nigga. Now look, when it comes to the finishing, say I was to do this, let's see. You know, then I only get five. If I build them like how, how I did right here. <clears throat> now, if you're gonna play Pro-Am and Wreck with this, um, <laughs> I don't know if people are hitting with a low free throw, but if not, you gonna have to take less shooting badges and like do shit like this, you know, 71, and you can rock it like these. I mean, but that's like best you could do. Um, you got like, you're gonna have like a 71 free throw. I think that'd be cool enough, um, to be honest. Um, but yeah, y'all let me know. You can make it like that or like this if you're just gonna play park and shit. All up to you, my boy. And the five playmaking, you really can get crazy playmaking if you like lower other shit, but I don't. Think it's worth it your, your job is to be a lot you don't have interceptor hall of fame pickpocket hall of fame a lot of niggas ain't gonna be having these badges bro in the game overall bro because everyone's making these power forward builds so you gonna really you know and then i'm hearing it's like easier to stop them niggas uh with hall of fame clamps so uh, you know i would want a higher vertical but um there's not really much i could really give for that but uh i think this lit y'all rate the bill down in the comment section and yeah let's get into you know and we made we made another two-way three level score i wish there were more bill names and more shades they're gonna figure out this is the best type of lock but um they might vary the badges but this is the base you know trendsetter swan Trendsetter Swan in the building, nigga. These niggas is my sons. Sun making Swan. 22 finishing badges on a 7 3 lockdown. Very toxic, right? This is a lockdown build. High speeds, bro. You're going to be able to have steel. Unlock all these power forwards. You're going to be able to have interior. Unlock all these power forwards. You're going to have strength. Unlike all these power forwards, you're going to have Max Vert. Unlike all these power forwards, 
Okay, so we got um, 23 shooting, bro. Uh, a lot of these badges that you see gold are going to eventually go purple. And um, this is enough shooting, bro. I don't, I don't need to knock my wingspan down to unlock, unlock Hall of Fame Limitless. I think this is beautiful, bro. Now, look, for playmaking, look. <laughs> I know a lot of y'all fucking idiots. By the way, this is the revitalized lock build that I already previously posted. This one is better because you unlock Intimidator. Um, look, you don't need playmaking as a lockdown. I don't know what's wrong with you idiots, bro. Like, a lot of y'all are just stupid, man. If you play with comp people, a comp team, if you play with randoms and stuff, then, you know, it might hurt you. But if you play with comp players... If you ever seen a comp stage game, the lockdown never touches the ball. If you ever seen a, a comp pro-am game, the lockdown almost never touches the ball, bro. The only time he touches the ball is on a fast break. He catches the ball and he goes and dunks it, bro. You know? You, you, you guys don't understand. If you don't play with a team and you don't know how to do comp meta tactics then this build not for you. I'm going to drop other lockdown builds with playmaking and shit like that, but this is just best overall, just pure lockdown, shooting, finishing God. And people have already did tests with speeds with ball. I proved it on stream. By the way, follow me on stream. you know, Lord Baby Hawk on Twitch. With, with a speed with ball 25 versus max, it, it, you're only one or two steps behind. Your speed will make up. You'll be fine, bro. You're one or two steps behind from max, uh, from from someone with max speed with ball. So you'll be fine, bro. You'll be fine when you catch the ball on the breaks or you get a steal and you go drive, my nigga. You got 22 finishing. You know, like, and if you guys haven't noticed, like, you're so stupid, bro. Stop reading into stats and shit. The hardest builds every year to rip have always been builds with less playmaking, with less ball handle. You guys never know that, but people with the highest ball handle get ripped easier. Don't know why. It's retarded. It's always been like that. If you actually play the game, you know this, right? You're never going to have the ball in your hands except on a break or when you get a steal oops shit like that like you're fine bro like if you play the comp meta tactic locks and you work around it bro usually locks catch the ball go hand it I, I'm, I'm done explaining bro i already made this build i'm gonna show you little dumb niggas right dumb niggas but look anywho you want to have max interior you feel me you're gonna have Max perimeter, you feel me? You're gonna have a 94 still take it down for the one time. You're gonna have a max block. So, look, you're gonna have a 56 offensive rebound. I don't like that too much. I did want to go 30 defensive badges on here, but I wanted to get more badges overall. And you're gonna have an 80 defensive rebound with the maxed out vert. You're gonna be playing, you're gonna have a higher vert than everyone you're playing versus. Verse. So your rebound's gonna look crazy with a 7-3 wingspan. You're gonna be at higher speeds. You're gonna have better animations. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be 95 speed. That's way higher than all these power forwards. You're gonna have a high ass acceleration. You actually got some strength, high vert, high stamina. You know, now look, here's another way on how to make this build if you want, um, the same badges, if you don't care about vert, bro, you could take vert down to 70. You could take it down to 70 and you get three more badges. Um, and you could do that. But me personally, bro, man, if I'm going to finish, bro, the difference between 25 and 22, bro, man, it ain't gonna be no goddamn difference, my nigga. Like, let, let's be honest. Y'all y'all really think it's gonna be a difference? I don't think it's going to be a difference. i rather have high-ass vert because last year in 2K20 and stuff like that, um, my my vert, it helped me stop legend paint beasts, legend comp paint beasts, bro. Comp players, 
and I only had, you know, 20 defensive badges and I was 6'6", right? So, you know, I'd rather have a stupid high vert, bro. And this is the build, bro. I believe this was the best lockdown build in the game. And um, I will make other versions of this. If you don't understand, you're just stupid, man. A lot of y'all niggas are dumb. You ain't touched the game, bro. <laughs> and we about to get the build names. Comment it down what build you think it's going to be before you see it. If you're right, I'm going to give you a PS5. Two-way, three-level score. So, look. <laughs> My nigga Giannis uh, signing that goddamn contract, bro, for five years. You know, that nigga don't want to chip, nigga, you know? Because he, he, you know, that, that that's basically what he's saying. Just like that bum-ass nigga Lillard. But, look, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to top to bottom, right? I'm going to explain why. So, we're going to have a 93 motherfucking layup, right? It's going to end up being a 97 at 99. <laughs> that's very toxic. Just like this nigga. 95 driving dunk. That's a 99 dunk. Okay. We're going to bring the standing dunk to a 93. Okay. That's 21 finishing badges, bro. 21. Okay. 21. Got to get a 21 down in the comments. Now look for shooting. Bring this up to 86. Bring this up to 81, and we're going to bring this up to 44, okay? 10 shooting badges. You could still be butter. You could shoot a lot better than the nigga do in real life. Now, look, listen. Now, if you're going to use this for Pro-Am and Rec, I don't know if niggas are hitting with low free throws, so I guess do your research on that first. But, um, of course, if you're going to if you're gonna do that, um, you know, you can switch the midi, switch the shooting up so you can have some free throw, I guess. You know, now for the playmaking, my nigga, look at this. This nigga's a god. You got 21 playmaking badges. So, you know how them niggas be like, oh, one pass, team takeover? You're going to be able to do all that shit. You're going to be able to bullet passer, Hall of Fame, Hall of Fame, Dimer, Hall of Fame floor. You're going to really be a team player with this nigga. And you're going to be able to take over. And once you're 99, you're going to be able to spam curry slides and every other move that any other guard or any build can do. You're going to have all the best dribble moves at 99 overall, bro. And at 97 overall, you get Hall of Fame quick first step. So it's pretty broken, bro. I don't know. <laughs> this game, bro. Oh, my God, bro. This shit is hella broken. Now, look at this, bro. So not only do I get all this crazy playmaking, all this speed, and by the way, you know, niggas is already showing that, you know, these these builds are just as fast as a as a PG when it when it comes to speed boosting, which is kind of dumb, but hey man. So look, 87 perimeter, you're gonna be able to guard anyone, even though defense is broken. You're gonna be able to guard with the best of them, my nigga. You steal is 91. Um, a lot of people don't have steal, so you're gonna be able to get hella interceptions hella pickpockets and if alley-oop cheese ever becomes a thing you're gonna be able to stop that shit instantly you feel me your block is max you're gonna have a 99 block that means a 99 contest and your rebounding is going to be 99 29 defensive badges bro this is amazing spot up this nigga is a fucking god bro um I'm thinking about making this myself, bro. <laughs> I ain't gonna hold you, bro. This nigga is a god, bro. Now look, check me out. Max that speed, max that excel, max that vert, max that stamina. So you have max. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. For all y'all niggas that be, uh, all y'all niggas that be. He has those trees. He's gonna get bullied. Hold on, I got y'all. I got y'all, bro. I got y'all. Bam. So look, we got motherfucking, we got interior and strength for all y'all niggas that lose your mind about it. You feel me? Got something for everybody, bro. But look, bro, this is a build for if you don't really buy into the idea about interior and strength, etc., all that other shit. Strength only really help you with uh, getting back down, bro. Um, Niggas ain't really post scores out there like that. If you play on the threes, you know, the twos, you, you got a big wingspan, bro. You got all these badges, bro. 
Like, I'm telling you, strength ain't ain't going to save you, my nigga. It, it really ain't. These extra badges will, though, okay? It will help your team out a lot. I'm hearing ankle braces OP, so you do need some extra, man, you know? Um, yeah, and as I was saying, bro, like, you can adjust this build if you want and um, switch up the shooting so you can have some free throw. But it's up to you, man. If any of y'all end up making this build, y'all let me know down in the comments if I should make this build, get some gameplay on it. Any of y'all make this build, hit me up on Twitter, man. Y'all rate this build 1 out of 10, man. Like, it can do everything, bro. Like, just really think about it, bro. But, hey. And here we go, man. Playmaking three-level score, man. Y'all let me know how many of y'all these you've seen in the park. And did y'all know it's rival day today? <laughs> Am I the only one that don't know? Then now these niggas get four times rep, man. I'm bigger than what you know. Most people make a six sevens, you know, six eights. Um, so you want to be bigger than that. <laughs> I mean, it, you know, you got a seven seven wingspan, but look, let's get into it. So ninety one driving layup, pretty op, right? Yeah, ninety five driving dunk, gonna be ninety nine. Okay, ninety nine standing dunk. Okay, you got twenty finishing badges on this nigga. Okay, you're, you're a demigod. Okay, we're gonna bring this midi up to 82. We're gonna bring this three point up to 78. Okay, and we're gonna bring this to nine. 43, you know, shooting badges. Um, if you mess with this, you're going to get less. You're gonna have over 83, you know, when you're 99 and stuff. You're gonna be able to bang with this. But um, if you kind of worried about wrecking stuff, I still think a lot of people aren't really upgrading. Uh, this is more of an inside, but you still can bang with this nigga. But um, I don't know, bro. Maybe free throws is hella easy to hit, but if you mess with the midi, lower it, stuff like that, you'll end up with like seven or six if you want your free throw up but overall man this is just overall you could do what you will i'll revisit this topic later on in the build vid but look so your pass accuracy is going to be at 83 bro uh 83 my nigga you know you're gonna have hall of fame dimer hall of fame bullet passer hall of fame bailout all this shit right that most centers aren't getting you're gonna be athletic and a hoe you're gonna be really helping your niggas out you 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 know y'all know when centers get the ball and they like pass it back and you know like all that it's a it's a it's a it's gonna be a big boost you know that something that ain't really you know we're gonna bring this to 33 okay and we're gonna bring this speed with ball to 50 eight nigga right and we gonna have nine playmaking badges that's pretty good it's pretty good it's pretty good now look this is where shit get crazy is shit shit was looking you know us oh, so, 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 so. but nah this is where shit get crazy this all around and anthony davis shit nigga we're gonna bring this hold to 85 80 85 we're gonna bring this hold to 79 what y'all see with a lot of centers bro is they leave off a whole category with this one you're not gonna see that <laughs> so look once you hit 99 you will unlock pickpocket um and you're already going to unlock interceptor too they're just not popping up right now you're gonna have a max block 99 block 99 rebounding on both deaths and 30 defensive badges nigga what you talking about? Okay, you got a little, you know, a little speed, you know. So look, man, I know the speed, the physicals aren't maxed, but I think overall for a center, this is cool. Um, acceleration, I'm, I'm hearing it only affects your speed with the ball and shit like that. So, you know, you're going to be able to get away with it. You got a 70 vert. That's cool. You know, I would want it to be maxed, but... um. You know, for the 30 defensive and just all around build, like, I think this, I think this hella nice. I know the stamina a little low. I do want it higher, but, you know, just, just think of it as you get gym rat. Say you get gym rat on this hoe and, um, then you get your plus four. It's an 85 stamina. I mean, people making vids saying you don't need the max stamina and shit like that. And, um, yeah, so I, I don't know. I, I, I think it's a comp build. I'm not a center. I don't really make centers. Um, I'm probably going to... I'm trying to do more every build type shit, you know? When when I play the game and stuff. So I can play the game more. Because it's hard ISO when find, finding two good enough spot-ups that can play D. It's a lot easier to join teams on a lock or a, a 
or a center so I could play more overall this year for y'all. Go ahead and pick. Man, I don't even know what I want, bro. Damn. Man, I'll go ahead and pick this. Fuck it, nigga. Fuck it, nigga. Y'all let me know what y'all would have picked. And you got a paint beast name. Ben Wallace, Andre Drummond, Clint Capella. I forces you to do it low key, bro. You know? Even without their, their intention, man. So look, we got 90. We're going to have 99 stamina, 99 acceleration, 99 speed. No vertical. You know, Steve Nash cannot get airborne, nigga. <laughs> and no strength, you know. Um, We're going to max out his rebound. We gonna max out his offensive rebound, right? Even though he wasn't really a rebound. I mean, he, you know, he he has some triple doubles and shit. But we're maxing it out for badge points, right? We're maxing out his block, and lastly, we're maxing out his steal. So you got a ninety-nine steal. So look, man. Twelve defensive badges, okay? Twelve. You know, he was a little pickpocket guy, my nigga. You're going to have Hall of Fame Interceptor, Hall of Fame Pickpocket. You're going to unlock Gold Rim Protector. So, you know, bruh, like, you know, it's, 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 it's valid, you know. But when you use this build, guys, listen, you're not supposed to guard ball, okay. Comp players for years, okay. If you guys don't know how to do it, they don't guard ball. They guard the corner and no one does shit about it. They have little midgets. People been doing it for years. I don't know what's wrong with y'all. Oh, I hope you make this build against me. I'm gonna, I will cook you. You don't have no perimeter defense, blah. Yeah, we're putting no perimeter defense and no interior, my nigga. Yeah, that's what we're doing, bro. But listen, guys, people have done this. It is proven. Comp players have, have rarely been exploited, bro. And only a certain level of people can really exploit it to play keep away okay not average people in the game you have to really be playing some real real geeks that it's below one percent of people that can actually do that shit bro you know if you got like a decent center and all that other shit and lock you know they guard ball for you you run guard corner they try to keep trying to force it nigga you have hall of fame interceptor and pickpocket with a 99 steal bro and you don't got no short wingspan you know you know, like niggas acting like they're just stupid or something, man. But <laughs> anywho, let's get into the rest of this build, man. So you're going to have a 99 speed with ball at 99. It's pretty incredible, eh? You're going to have a 92 ball handle. This means you're going to unlock Hall of Fame ankle breaker. Okay, it's pretty nice. We're going to bring the pass accuracy up to a 69. You're going to basically be able to unlock dimer floor general on gold it's, it's it's good enough bro i think like 96 um shit like that or, or 97 for 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 all of the playmaking shit that's not highlighted you're shooting we're gonna bring your free throw up to 86 y'all know steve nash was a great free throw shooter y'all let me know how y'all think he gonna do in uh the nets uh on brooklyn man i don't uh, I don't think he really, you know, I think I think them niggas running this shit, man. Hopefully, KD and them boys stay uh, healthy so um, LeBron can really just thrash niggas and, like, you know, like, there's no excuses, you know? I wish Clay Thompson stayed healthy for the same reason. But, um, yeah, bro, this is the bill, man. This is the bill. This is the build. This is the build. This is the build, my nigga. Okay. I think this is amazing. 28 shooting badges. You don't need no shooting badges. <laughs> Shut up, my nigga. You don't need nothing in life, my nigga. This just gonna make shit even easier and make you like just a stupid god. When you play comp, you're gonna have advantages. When you play certain type of defenders, you're gonna have more wiggle room, more help more bailout ability to really be a god my nigga okay this is just for shooting bro you know niggas you shooting like crazy you know you can still get your layup in bro it's good enough people have made no finishing builds in other 2ks and we're perfectly fine my nigga okay this is not my main build no that's it i'm just giving y'all options to make bro you want to be a little stage or comp geek 
This is what niggas do, man. Um, if y'all want a PG with perimeter defense, go check out my Curry build, okay? And um, also, I will be making a PG build later on with a mate, okay? Make sure y'all like the video, man. Subscribe if you're new, and you are a shot creator build, bro. Have y'all even have y'all seen this out here in the park? Have y'all seen niggas make this shit? <laughs> Fred Van Vel Limited. You're gonna be messing around with two bad. Uh, I'm gonna just show you, bro. Look. 99 layup, right? Westbrook. 99 dunk. Westbrook. Okay. 13 finishing badges, right? 13. It's phenomenal. 6-3. Niggas ain't gonna really be expecting you to really be. You know, so we're gonna bring his three point to a ninety five. I know y'all niggas gonna be hating in the comments, but look, shut up. What happened to Curry last night? Oh, hey, if Curry don't go to the playoffs, if he don't have an MVP caliber season, damn, he really not a one man show, nigga. A role player, overrated. <laughs> you know, my, my nigga, my nigga Westbrook turns niggas into all stars and give them MVP seasons, nigga. That's how great of a teammate he is. But look, you know, Westbrook actually does have a high midi in real life. If you guys didn't know. Um, we're going to give him 16 shooting badges, correct? Um, he's going to be able to hit the free throws, the rec build, all that other shit, pro-am build. You know, the midi at the 84, that's nice, you know, 88 midi. 99 three, going to be hella toxic. Hall of Fame circus three, he's going to be able to go crazy, my nigga. I don't think power, f what is the cap for circus threes? Does anyone know? Um... I don't know. I don't think power forward builds can get it. So, yeah. Um, I did want to max out all this playmaking, but I, I just wanted more access to defense. So, we're going to have a 99 speed with ball. It's very accurate. You know, Westbrook is a demigod. Um, you're going to unlock Hall of Fame ankle breaker at like 96 or 7. And um, yeah, you get 18, you're gonna be able to unlock Floor General, Dimer, as you upgrade your nigga, okay? Um, 99 steel, okay, very toxic. We'll max that block out, you know? Wait, hold on, let me, let me, uh, let me, let me, uh, let me apply them. Uh, you know, he's probably the hardest player ever in NBA history, I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Like, stamina meter, I think he might, I think he's like number one. Where, 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 where do y'all rank him? Y'all think anyone plays as hard as him? Um, 99 speed, 99 acceleration. Mm, you know, big boy shit, nigga. Now look, check me out. Nine defensive badges. I know. No perimeter. Blah, blah, blah. Look, 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 dickhead. Let me explain this shit to you, okay? <clears throat> look, I'm going to explain this shit to you, bro. To get this many badges, this is what, what, what you got to do, bro. Look, you gotta you're gonna have 99 speed running around and shit. You just you know you gotta be wise with how you 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 guard niggas. You know, um, of course you're gonna have to have a primary defense is so bad anyways, bro. I I would I wouldn't be surprised if someone did a test and the test between 25 and like 99 is like like not crazy. Like I'm so serious, bro. It's like it's bad, bro. You get beat, bro. There's like. If, if niggas get a nudge on you, there's, like, no recovery. <laughs> like, it, it's bad, bro. But, um, yeah, man, you're going to have a primary lockdown defender. You're going to have someone who primary guards, primarily guards ball, and you're going to be going for the interceptions, the steals. You don't have no little baby-ass wingspan. you got a nice little contest. You're going to be able to unlock rim protector etc bruh so you're gonna be cool man you're gonna unlock rim protector hall of fame pickpocket hall of fame intercept it don't really matter my nigga and we are a scoring machine and look shades of shades of russell rustbrook man lillard little bitch ass and baron davis so you know i know what i'm saying buddy 